Let's be clear, guys. Anybody that calls themselves a Christian should not be voting for Kamala Harris and the Socialist Democratic Party. This party goes against your Christian values, folks. Does anybody believe that Kamala Harris is actually a Christian? I mean, she never actually brings up God. Her God is the left. She promotes a whole bunch of things that are anti-Christian, like abortion, transgenderism, a lot of radical left Marxist stuff. This woman is a communist, folks. And when it comes to Marxism, they destroy religion. They don't believe in God. So how can you Christians go out there and vote Kamala Harris? Now, I'm talking to you black people also. Even though Trump is actually getting um, a bigger support of black people. But still, how can you black people go into the church and then walk out and cast your vote for Kamala Harris? How can you do that? Why would you actually vote against your religious beliefs? God doesn't believe in transgenderism, folks. This woman, Kamala Harris, openly mocking. A Christian. She actually has some type of rally or something, folks. And. You can actually hear a person say Jesus is Lord. And then Kamala Harris tells him, oh, I think you're in the wrong place. Yes, we got the video, guys. Actually, we got two clips because on the first clip, you can't hear the protest to say Jesus is Lord. For one thing, the reason he said that. Is because Kamala Harris was talking about abortion and folks, Democrats have never met a baby that they don't want to abort. These people are sick, guys. They are absolutely sick. Let's go and do it, guys. Right here. Now, this is the first clip here. I'm glad that I actually found this one right here because this clip right here, you can actually hear the protester say Jesus is Lord and Kamala Harris mocks him. Let's listen in. Yeah. You guys saw that right there. You guys saw that right there. And all of these people right there. And you know what? Kamala's slogan now is a new way forward. Man, that sounds a whole lot like communism, folks. It definitely does. But I wanted you guys to actually hear the person say Jesus is Lord. Kamala Harris heard it, folks. This is her response right here. So let's go ahead and play this right here. Christians, you can't vote for a man. Watch this. With the intention that they would undo the protections of Roe v. Wade, and they did as he intended. <laughs> oh, you guys are at the wrong rally. Man, these are some evil people, man. Absolutely evil people. Kamala Harris talking about abortion, killing unborn babies. Then someone comes up and says, Jesus is Lord. And Kamala Harris, the Marxism comes out of her, folks. She mocks this person. How can you Christians go out there and vote for this? I know that I don't have the biggest voice out there. But still, I'm letting my my opinion be heard here. How can you actually go out there and vote for this? This woman 
is mocking your faith. Her faith is the left. Her faith says to abort babies at will. No exceptions. Kamala Harris doesn't believe in any exceptions, folks. This is how radical she is. Comrade Kamala, folks, is a danger. A danger. You got so many people out there, guys, that's going to vote blue no matter who. But I found it really, really crazy that you actually will have people that will go to church on Sunday, like early voting, for example, starts on Monday out here in uh, Texas. You're going to have people go to church on Sunday. Maybe the maybe the pastor is actually talking about, hey, it's wrong to abort babies and they're going to be in the pews. Amen. Amen. Pastor, you're right. You're right. You're right. Uh, they may be talking about uh, homosexuality is wrong and stuff like that. And they're going to be like, all right, pastor, you're right. You're right. You're right. Praise Jesus. Monday. Maybe they take their friend. Hey, let's go vote. OK, let's do it. Who are we voting for? Oh, we're voting for Kamala Harris. That's a problem, folks. That is a serious problem. I guess I call these kind of people, um, you know, Christians one day a week on Sunday. Then they're heathens the rest of the week. That's a problem. That is a serious problem, folks. Now, the majority of this country still identifies as Christian. I believe it's something like 65, 67 percent. Of the population. If Kamala Harris did this in the 1980s, she'll be done. She will be done. But this just tells you, man, how far left and radical the Democrats are now. This is crazy, man. That was a complete insult. She laughed in the face of believers of God. I have no respect for that, man. Absolutely no respect for that. And you shouldn't either, man. Maybe you guys should actually uh, share this with your friends. Maybe they'll actually wake up. Because you got you got some blind followers of Democrats, man. Their religion is Democrat. That's all they know. That is all they know. You cannot be a Christian and vote Democrat, folks. You just can't do it. That's just my thoughts on this. What do you guys think of this? Black and white network fans, let us know what you think about all this in the comments. Make sure to subscribe to the channel. And we'll catch you next time.